I'm flattered you picked up. I well, didn't listen. know where we stood, Ryan. I got to tell you something. Andy Cohen and Ryan Seacrest are setting the record straight amid rumors of a feud. Calling into On Air with Ryan Seacrest on January 5th, Andy attempts to clear the air two days after Ryan claimed the Bravo star snubbed him while they were each hosting their New Year's Eve specials. I like watching people fight. I don't like fighting with people. Oh. Well, we're not. We're not. That's the funny thing, you know, is that we're not. Some people think you and I have this thing going on, which just isn't true. Ryan then notes that the pair have been pals for well over a decade, explaining how they were even texting about the weather heading into the big night. This is really an Anderson thing. I called Anderson and yelled at him on the radio yesterday. I was on my radio show yesterday. One of us will nudge the other and say, hey, there's Seacrest. Look, there's Ryan. Right. And right. I said, this year you did not do that. Ryan hosted Dick Clark's New Year's Rockin' Eve and Andy CNN's New Year's Eve Live alongside Anderson Cooper. During the January 4th episode of his Sirius XM podcast, the Watch What Happens Live host addressed the drama head on, calling in Anderson for backup. Don't you usually hit me on the side and say, hey, there's Ryan Seacrest? Talking, you were talking, I don't know, you were involved in like some You were drinking. You, right. I, yeah, I was like, what was coming? <laughs> Up. Dealing with so, the show, right. Right, and so I just didn't, I mean, it all happened so fast, it wasn't a big deal. Andy's explanation came one day after Ryan brought up the alleged incident on Live with Kelly and Ryan. When I was not working, I was trying to, like, get their attention. And <laughs> I just, I thought maybe I was in the shot, I just wanted to wave and say hi. You know, they have a great show. And, you know, Anderson, the, the best, he turns <laughs> around and he says, Yeah. Have a good show. Class. Yes. He, yes. Andy did not turn around. Back in November, CNN announced its decision to curb on-air drinking, a move Ryan later applauded after being dissed by Andy last year. Ryan Seacrest, group of losers that are performing behind us. I mean, with all due, if you've been watching ABC tonight, you've seen nothing. Regarding the network's change, Ryan told Entertainment Weekly in December, I don't know how that started as a tradition, but it's probably a good idea, CNN. There's some pretty respectable people, or at least one, right? I think there's a serious journalist and then a friend of mine who has a lot of fun. But it's probably a good idea. Looks like it's all water under the bridge after all.